what's up everybody welcome back to the channel so you see i got the doors open on the ram because we're going to be doing some interior upgrades uh before we begin though please hit that subscribe button hit that bell notification so you don't miss out on any videos and now let me show you what i got also if you're here and you want to see the review on the max liner all weather floor mats just go towards the end and you'll see my review on it so here i'm about to show you what i got and i just want to show you oh he's moving over here already this little frog trying to find a little hiding spot <laughs> all right let me show you what i got all right so we got some new door seal guards so we got this nice little plate that says ram on it for the front and then on the back it has a plate it doesn't say ram or anything on it but still got a nice little shiny plate on the back i'll show you what's currently installed in my ram uh, this is a big horn and uh, so it's just got the basic ones so uh, how about we get started and uh, we'll see what they look like. All right, so it should be pretty simple to remove. Just grab a hold of it and hopefully I can do it with one hand, just pull straight up. Try not to break any tabs. See, I get my fingers under there. Be able to try to get a hold of it. Get it disconnected from up here. All right, there we go. All right, it's pretty simple. There's two tabs up here, and of course we got the one down here on the bottom. All right, so we got the new one. So we'll start up here, kind of try to work it in here and spot. Find where my tabs are. I got that one up there. Let's see. All right, I think I got that part. All right, so I shouldn't just be able to, once you get it lined up, you should be able to just push it in and get it to snap like that. And these should hopefully be lined up pretty good. Start from the front, make our way back. Now it looks like it's, it's really easy actually. I think I got one more. Snap, let's see. All right, so I thought I missed a snap or had it misaligned. So like right here, about where the A is on the ram, it doesn't feel like it's seated all the way, but there's actually, it's kind of like a brace that's put in there. And I guess for whenever people step on there, it'll help uh, support the, the weight of the person. But, uh, that's what the front passenger side looks like. So uh, let's get started with the back. All right, so the back one, we're gonna start from the front and make our way back. Looks like we got one more tab right there. Here we go. Okay, there we go. That's easy. So once you get past this one right here, they come out super easy. Now right, let's grab the new one. All right, so the new one, we'll take and we'll start with this small one right up here. And it goes in right here in this little, little part right there. You can see a bunch of wires down in there too. Hmm get this lined up that kind of snap all right so it looks like for this bottom one right here oh look how dirty that is so we need to push back on this and that should line this one right here up So there's that one. Now let me knock out the, uh, the driver's side and uh, I'll show you what it looks like when I'm done. All right, driver's side's done. So now, get the satisfaction of peeling these off. That does look good. Sad it'll, it'll end up being scratched up, but it looks good right now. 
And now for the rear. Here's what that one looks like. Hey, I'm already getting this thing dirty. Need to clean it. So that's what that looks like. And then far away with this one. That's what it looks like right there. So as I was finishing everything up, I started thinking and now I got an issue. So let me show you what I'm talking about. So as I put my uh, all weather floor mats in, I used the max liner. <sighs> I ran into this issue right here. <laughs> so I literally just put these on and I put my floor mats back on and they're freaking covered. <laughs> I don't even know if there's a point of leaving it on. So should I, maybe, should, maybe I'll end up changing the floor mats, see if there's any other options. But I mean, I kind of like the floor mat coming over like that because it protects everything. But like I might sleep on it tonight and decide if I actually want to keep these uh, door seal guards because you can't even see them. But you see a little peak right there. And then for the back, a little peak right there. But uh, <laughs> anyways, I'll, uh, I'll do my review on the uh, Max Liner floor mats. So this is the passenger side. Hasn't been used as much, but I mean, they... They're, they're pretty durable. They hold up quite well. And like the on my back one, I'll show you that. Kind of see it. I mean, it's got like a couple marks on it and stuff. But I mean, I do throw like fish and stuff back here. You can probably see where it's kind of pushed in a little bit there now. But uh, no, the driver's side actually does have a little bit of wear. Go ahead and show you. So this one's been used the most. I've uh, been using it for, heck, uh, uh, a little over a year. Actually, well, now almost a year and a half, actually. And, uh, I mean, they're still they're still in really good shape. And I'll show you this right here. Got a nice little plate right there. And a phone number to call. And the website. But uh, I'll, end up, I'll put that in the link below. I wish you can get to it pretty quickly. But uh, that's my review on that. And uh, as far as the door seal guards <laughs> I really don't know if there's any point in keeping it because they're going to be covered but that's the reason why I put the plastic back on whenever I put the mats on just in case uh, I want to take them back off and uh, sell them to somebody somebody that doesn't have like all weather floor mats or something so if you do have these floor mats just know if you get these door seal guards they will be covered and if you already have these and you're thinking about getting these mats, just know that it'll be covered. I uh, hope you all enjoyed this video. Uh, my quick little review on this and then the uh, install on the door seal guards. But uh, if you can, just do me a big favor. Give this video a big thumbs up. And uh, if you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button. Hit that bell notifications. And I'll see you in the next one.